All right, hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Indivisible here on the channel where we're back in Kinul City, a little underground city here, trying to find out any leads on some extra stuff to do before we go to the final boss area ish. So let's talk. You name is Taco, right? Taco, Taco, yep. What about Corn Counter? You beat the Serpent Queen. Yeah. Who will protect us now? Right, I think he already talked about us. Talked with us about this, yeah. Gotale, yep. Oh, he's the counter. He's the corn counter. Well, yeah, I mean this corn. He is the corn counter. Which also made me wonder, we should probably have a Ladar in here, because Dar's only got seven hearts. Dar needs more hearts, y'all. Dar needs way more hearts. So let's get Dar in there for some extra stuff while we... If we have to fight anything down here, you know? Never forget that you are together. Yep, yeah, got it. Now, is there breakable walls or anything here? Right, it's down and around. Okay, so it's down here, but it's like... Up here where it's... Bam. Look at this. Look at this sweet cheesums. Hey, what's up here, though? I just saw a ladder and I got excited. I thought there was maybe a secret. Like a secret of the ages. Alright, it's just this. Can we get above... We get above that? How do we get above that? How is one... How does one do the things that these do? Is there a way I could maybe, like... Do this? But upwards in the water? Is there, like, a thing I can inverse? Is there, like, an inverse... The world function? Like in Bloodstained Ritual of the Night, where I actually had to look up how to invert the world, because I didn't understand the fighting game input at first, because I'm an idiot. All right, so let's see. We can't go up there. That's a place we know. It looks like a bunch of stuff that we can get is like tricky stuff, like stuff we haven't learned the tricks of yet. Because there's nothing up over here. I mean, that says a story, but I'm pretty sure we already went up there for story. And then any more eyeballs? I mean, there's the question mark down there, but so far we can't do question marks. All question marks have been blah, blah, blah. So is this actually a place we need to go next? Is down into the left? Pretty sure down into the uh, left is a, a place we could go. So let's go down and to the left, shall we? I just fell straight up through that guy. What about you? You are no monster. Got you. I'm gonna talk to everybody, pretty much. I guess you know. You never know what people are gonna say this time around. We've gated off a new area. We're actually here for business. We're actually here for vacation. So down into the left? Yeah, down into the left. What if I just did this? What if I just uh, gathered up my 80 right here in the middle of this here uh, summoning circles? Right, so this leads to the queen's chamber again. Which I don't think we can get through again. I don't think it'll let us through. So... Anything that's down there is pretty much just gated off to us, I'm pretty sure. So whatever's down there, we missed. Yeah, that's, uh... That's kind of a bummers. So what is even there to do here, then? What, what is there even to do here? Because we can't go there. And if we take the... Uh... If we take the teleport back, we can't get, like, back up. I don't think we might be able to get back up if we traverse. And is it, so is that the only way to get back up to that area? But there's not a question mark there or anything. So do we have to go back to the Iron Kingdom? Did I have I just wasted it all of your time? Have I just wasted everybody's time? I don't want to be wasting your time. I can't do it. Oh man, like I, like I said, or do I just have to defeat the final boss and like come through? A second time, like, some RPGs are just like that. Like, you can't do things until you beat the game once already. And I hate games like that, because I don't want to beat a game a second time if I don't want to. Like, they completely... Uh... Rely and bank on you just... Wanting to play the game more. And I mean, I'd probably play this more if there was like... Oh yeah, New Game Plus does this, 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 and this different. I might... On my own time, maybe not for the, the show, but, like, I might on my own time. But, like, not 
regularly, like I wouldn't just want to immediately go back through. The only game I ever felt that I immediately wanted to go play through, like immediately right after beating it, was South Park The Stick of Truth. The South, South Park The Stick of Truth is the only game where immediately after beating it, I started a new save file, went with a different class, and beat the game again. And I don't know why it was just that good to me. Because, I, I, you know, it's the kind of games I like. It's an RPG. It's turn-based. You know? It's got all the things that hit all the notes. And I was just like, man. I guess this game's my jam. And then I don't even really remember playing uh, South Park The Fractured But Whole. Because I had a fever. I was sick with the flu. Oh, come on. Don't be like, no, he's not flowery enough to flower your flower. Man. So, yeah, like, I was sick, and I had the flu, and I beat it in three days, but I had three days of the flu. So I was basically just laying down on my couch in a blanket, m mixing between being too hot to sleep, and then being too cold to stay awake so I'd pass out, and then being too hot to sleep so I'd wake up again, play video games, and then get too cold to stay awake and I'd pass out, and then I'd wake up and be too hot to sleep. <laughs> like... That's that, and then I would play the game, and I don't remember like the majority of it. I remember stuff like, you know, Stan Stan's name is Tool Shed, like Tokens, the Tupperware Kid. You know, he's got the t oh, pardon me, hiccups, Jesus. Tokens got like Tupperware on him and stuff, and Cartman's the Coon, but that's you know that's stuff from the show, so I would know that regardless. But yeah, like it's just certain things, like I just don't remember. And I, like, I, but the thing is, I don't have that drive to go play it again. Like, even though I don't remember being it, I don't have the drive to go back and play it again. Which is usually weird. So, Iron Kingdom, I'm guessing? Iron Kingdom? Iron Kingdom it is. But yeah, there's a few games I've wanted to revisit recently. Uh, some not for the show, some for the show. But then I'm like, maybe I don't want to revisit games for the show. Like, not games that I've done on the show, but just like, you know, stuff. Wait, I've been down here. There's a ring cell down here, but I can't get through it, so. Whatever, right? Because view map. Yeah, I can't get down here. I can't do anything down here with the abilities I got. Because I need to be able to, like, pound my way up, right? Yeah, there's the goo there that I can't shoot through. And I can't use, like, my, uh, up pogo stab to get through it either. Well, that was not the up pogo stab, but thank you, game. Uh, okay, there we go. I was hitting the wrong button, that's all. I was gonna be like, uh, is this game just being, like, dumb? Yeah, no, it will not let me go through there. But there was this through here, though, which is, I believe, leads to nothing, because I can't get through here either. So, I mean, there's, like, stuff that, like, I can't even get through. So, we got to be able to come back at some point. Like, there has to be some way to be able to come back. You know? Because I have not gotten, like, some secret moves here that, like, I need for traversal. And that's just not, like, you know, it's not fresh with me. It's not sitting right. It's not kosh. Maybe we'll go see if we can't, uh, just talk to the people around here. Oh, I'm from a noble family. Yes. I understand the position. Honestly, I do, but they could just ask me. Do uh, you freely give your money away? Certainly. Came from the people's taxes, after all. All right. Iron Kingdom. Yep. I think we were asking about Mavis, or not Mavis, but Campan. Oh, it's Lennox. Moloch may be gone, but the kingdom's ambitions are running wild. I guess I can't really do anything about that. Ain't asking you to, but me, I got no money. Might have to re-enlist. I feel for you as a soldier myself, as a lieutenant in R Ravonavar's army. Well, if I ever do command a unit again, spare a bit of sympathy for the boots on the ground, will you? I hope to avoid that life. Me too, but here we are. No money, no prospects, nothing but this grimy sack on my back. We aim to make the world a better place for everyone. We will do our best. I've heard that before, but I'll take any shred of hope you've got to offer. I mean, I wish we had something. Also, I don't have my headphones on, but I'm pretty sure my Discord just went off. 
So I'm going to turn that off for y'all so you don't hear that. Because sometimes when I'm playing a game on my console, like my PS4 or my Switch, I don't have my computer headphones on, which means I can't hear when uh, my Discord goes off. So I can't shut it off if I forgot to. And uh, you bet your sweet skanky potato, I definitely had my Discord on. And uh, it probably just went off. So there you go, stanky potato or no. You'll probably hear like a doop, and it'll be like, oh, is that my Discord? Be like, no, it was my Discord because I'm a jerk. I am a jerk that gave you false sense of Discord notifications. And you'll be like, no, but why? Okay, no. Oh, what? I hit you though. You know what? Spin to win, baby. It's not going to do any damage on this thing, though. Because this thing's just got way too much armor. Alright, come on, Dyer. Get all those get all those rocks up, baby. But you know what I could do? Oh! Pump it! I feel like... I feel like the super macho man. Just pump it! And then Dar here can just be like, pop it off. Bam. So much damage. No, I didn't block right. Eh. Have some healing. Also have rocks. Uh-oh, I did the wrong one. That's fine. I just get Ajnaf in there to attack too. You know what? Here, have some of this. Bap. Brap. Have some more brap. I accidentally didn't hold the button for uh, the proper amount of time either. Let's see here now. So this takes up... Oh yeah, that takes up a whole bar of 80. Yeah, so I can't do that. If I don't have enough 80, I forgot about that. Because every time we'd use it, we would just have like a full bar of 80. So, is there a casino around here? Yeah, you guys are nobodies. I don't need to talk to none of y'all. Y'all don't know what a girl needs. A girl needs ring cells and a sense of adventure. And a view of the map. Alright, so there's something over there we could probably do. Uh, oh, right, the ring cell we couldn't get because we don't have that ability to get up between those things. Hold on now. What, you? Are you somebody? You're hungry? I want to eat chocolate chip cookies. Man, I don't got no chocolate chip cookies. Of course it's you again, Jesus. What about you, sir? Believe in yourself and never give up. That's the fighting spirit. I mean, but yeah, I can't do anything about it. Like, can't do anything about that, sir. I can't get up there. I need, like, a world cleave from beneath. I need, like, a, a chopper cut. A world-ending chopper cut kind of uppercut that just absolutely decimates a full-grown man's jaw. The kind of uppercut where the doctor sees your jaw and's like, what the hell happened to you, kid? And then the guy's just like, can't talk. Because his mouth is like, broken. And then he won't be able to talk anymore for like months after that. Because his jaw will be wired shut. So, you know, that kind of uppercut. Never let anyone dull your sparkle. Never have flavor text. That's irrelevant to my current situation. Haha. -ha. Alright, let's see what we got here now. Save that. Dopity dopes. Starting to, uh... Get a little upset, y'all. I'm starting to wonder where everything is. Where, like, all the peeps are. Where, you know, where all the quests is at. You know, where, where all them, uh extra characters are. I mean, I'm pretty sure I probably missed some, but haha, -ha, whatever. Let's see here. I can just walk in through the front gate now, can't I? Oh. Oh, would you look at this? Would you look at this? Well, I didn't know I could do that to them. Well, there's the front gate for sure. Oh, ho, ho. speaking of a front of gate through. Look at this specialness right here. I'm just going to keep going this way, though. 
Because I've never been here. Oh. I'm just saving in case there is like a secret boss or something. Like, you never know. Okay, so I've finally been through there. Uh, oh, up there is um Boyle. Our buddy... And Kyridian, I forget his name. Yuri Nomos. How could I forget Yuri Nomos' name? That boy is solid. He's solid good. Yuri Nomos is like the best robot I've ever met, so how could I forget his name? I feel very upset that I forgot his name now. Did I f at least fill in some of that room? Yeah, okay, I did. Can I maybe like climb back up here or. Because this says it goes all the way back up, but like, does it though? Oh, it's not wide enough for me to do a jump between. Garbage time. Well, if we wanted to go talk to Yuri Nomos again, we could. Or we could start going through and finding out, like, what's beneath here through the secrets. I think I want to go through the floor here. Having La smash a rooney Oh, this is just back here. Okay, so view map. This is just back to this place. So this is how we get back to the boss room-ish, but also not quite, because I, I think we can just run through the other way to the boss room. So I'm just going to go yoink and get all the way back up here. Because there's no point in going down here anymore. Oh, come on now. Unless, of course, you... Oh, come on. What is this game doing to me? It's like getting me up there, but then it's dropping me. There we... Okay, what? 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 Okay, what? What? Is there just like an invisible wall there now? Did I just destroy my life? There is! Look at that! I can't get back up! Look at that! I can't get back up! I can't get back up! Look, it's not even letting me like axe my way out! What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, have I already used... Oh, wait, did I already use my axe? I think I already used my axe, that's why. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so, will this let me axe my way out now? Because, like, I can't actually get out of here. Like, I, yeah, I can't. I can't. Hold on. One more time. I can't believe this is this garbage. Let's see if I can't, like... See? Yeah, if I do that, it just... Wow. Alright, I guess we're going through. I wanted to go. I didn't want to go through here, but I guess we have to. Haha, -ha, funny, funny. Haha, -ha, can't program uh, invisible walls. Here we go. Man, that's a bunch of garbage. That adds like 10 minutes to our run. Jesus. There you go, I sound like a uh, speedrunner. I mean, that's going to add 10 minutes to our run. I just mean that's going to add 10 minutes to the episode. And like a garbage 10 minutes too, not even like a fun 10 minutes. Yeah, whoop. That's what we call abusing them hitboxes, dog. Yeah, yeah. I think I was supposed to hit the switch there, but whatever. I can do it without the switch, honestly. No! Jesus. Come on, man. It's just this lava keeps popping up when I don't need it to. Come on, lava. Get out of the way. Come on, man. Just need you to be gone. Perfect. So where are we now exactly in, in this calamitous area? All right, we're almost back up where we want to be. Almost. I don't need I don't need to hit no switches. This game this game knows I'm I'm legit. This game knows I'm way too legit to quit. This game knows I got the moves. Ah, uh, Shiza. Hold on now. There we go. So where are we? Uh, I think we actually need to go this way. Yeah, I think we do. 
All right, so we gotta just wait for the lava. And I gotta itch my nose again. My, oh, my nose is so itchy today. My face in general is just itchier than normal. Oh, Jesus. Just itchier than normal. Must be because I'm getting annoyed at all the, uh... Flip. At all the things that I keep having to do when I shouldn't have to do them. There we go. All the extra running around now. I am where I need to be, right? Yes, perfect. This is where I want to go. This is where I want to be. And we will save it. So nothing bad happens. We can't get up there. We know that. We can't get through here either. Wonderful. Okay, let's just um, uh, cry inside and die. <laughs> That's where life is right now. Let's just cry inside and die. Let's see, where is... Alright, yes, yeah, so we can just go through this way. And not fall down the hole that's coming up. Because if we fall down that hole, I might actually cry and die. Alright, so this we can do, though. We can just pop this guy. Use him as a platform. Because we need him to get up. Back up to uh, where Yuri Nomos is. Isn't there supposed to be another one that falls down here? Or do I just duck under this? I think I ducked under that. Okay. It's hard to uh, remember exactly where those guys started falling down from the sky and started uh, making platforms for us. Like right here is one of them. But because uh, they they did that all along the outside, I think of this roof, other oh, roof. I heard that you wanted to get up on the outside of my roof. I don't know why that's like the accent of today, but it is. Oh, Jesus, no! You ever wonder why it's just always specifically Jesus now? It's never like Moses, no. Or any of the other deities, no, like Maui. Like Maui, no. Like, oh, Jesus, Maui, no. Or, oh, Maui, God damn it. Well, I guess it would be Oh Maui Demigod, damn it. You know, just to be uh, accurate to Maui status. Hold on. Alright, I thought I felt something crawling on my arm. Turns out it was just a weird hair maneuver. Like an arm hair crinkle caused by like another falling hair from my shirt or something. But I thought it was something crawling on my arm. I was about to be mildly annoyed at whatever creature thought it could jump on me like that and then, you know, kill it immediately because anything that crawls on me dies. As long as my repairs are incomplete, I cannot move from this place, but I wish you well, child of Ender. Alright, so... We came up here for nothing. Hooray! He wasn't giving us any additional insight to anything here. So I have failed... Everyone and everything. And I don't know how to get through this place. Like, I don't know how to trigger any more additional anything besides the final quest. I've been to every one of the three cities. Oh, I jumped into it by accident. That's my bad. No worries, hold on. No worries, hold on. We'll, we'll just, uh... There we go. We'll just mash these guys up. And then we'll target this guy. And then we'll up. All right, and we'll have to down, right? Down and up. There we go. Did that break his guard? Cool. And we'll do. Oh no! Dang it! His guard's back up. All right. So hold on. We're gonna have to do this specialty though, like this. I did this spin wrong, but whatever. That's some good damage, though. That's some good damage. We'll have to get uh, Tarani in there to hold on. We'll do this first. There you go. We'll get Tarani in here, and then we'll pop off a of level three so she sits there for a bit. And then we'll get Dara in here to attack a bit, and then we'll get Tarani to stand there and attack. Boom. Look at that. So precious. So clean. Oh, yeah, baby. Blocked. Blocked. You know what's coming next? 
the Hadouken spin! I love it, because I just love Dar and his massive damage that he can do. Dar is like the damage-dealing beast. Right, so I'm going to need to uh, get some of that on there. You know what? I'll just keep spinning. Spinning to win is my favorite thing. And maybe only doing like one damage. But that's fine. All right, Dar, come on, baby. Broke that guard for that guy. That's perfect. And then we'll just do a double spin. We'll just do two spins. Just a nice little, you know, just a nice little spin. Boom, perfect guard. And then, uh, yeah, we'll take out this big, big boy here. Actually, you know, we should probably switch. We switch tactics to fighting this guy here, and then break his guard. There we go, and then we can just go in here and chew this guy up a ton. And get Dar in there, too. Dar will just destroy that guy now that he's got a bunch of rocks around him. Like, come on. Boom! Rocked. Oh, I love that uppercut. Does that uppercut use itty? Oh, the uppercut does use itty. Okay. Okay. So she's got main attacks that don't use Itty, which is nice. For uh, Leilani there. I like Leilani. I like her play style. I like her spin to win attitude. Now, I was never a fan of Garen, Mr. Spin to win Demacia in League of Legends. But uh, I respected it. Hated it, but I respected it. Because it was just so spinny to win. You become my team. I could swear that there's still something left to do with Kampan and everything. So, I don't know, maybe... Maybe I'm supposed to come back? Maybe I'm supposed to come back or something? I've got a match against the Kingdom of Griffins next week. We can't get through here or anything, so... I don't know, I'm thinking maybe I'm supposed to go do the final thing and then come back, y'all. It just seems too... Too barren, you know? There should be some sort of inkling or lead or anything trying to show me the, the righteous path, you know? But I'm not seeing anything concrete. Not in any of these kingdoms. What about this guy? Did he say anything? No, nah, call me Scarecrow. Whatever. Then we already listened to the cute red-headed thief woman there. Who's going to thief a bunch of stuff. Because she's cute and red-headed and that's what they do apparently. I don't know. I just, it's just what the movies tell me, y'all. If they got that cute, weird, you know, face-framing red-headed haircut. And they're like dressing in black types, hanging out on roof type, rooftop types. They're probably going to steal your stuff. It's just how it is. Now, is there anything else down here? I could maybe... No? Alright. Alright, Bautai. Take me to Port Marifa. Uh, wrong way. Take me to Port Marifa. <sighs> We're gonna go see what we can do after going to the final place. I mean, it, like... It just feels like it's not the final, final place. Just because there's two chakra gates we have not opened. And unless I've s skipped, like a huge portion of this game, I don't think I'm there yet. I think I'm supposed to do something where, like, if I defeat the final boss, like, something resets or recycles, and then I have to do this all over again, but it's going to change because my, all my friends are going to be with me this time. So, like, I mean, I don't even have the orange, man. I didn't even get the orange power up. Whatever that does, wherever that's from, whoever that's from, you know, it's got to be from a story character that you can't miss, so... But uh, I think we're getting her up on time here for the episode, so I'm going to call it here. And uh, we'll pick it up here in the... in the Chakra Gate ley line of the Void kind of deal, you know, where we're getting to choose our next path. 
and then we'll see what happens when we pick the path of no return. But I just had a great idea before before I do, just so that way I don't forget when doing all the between episode chores that I do. I'm going to save it here, and I'm going to save it here, and I'm going to save it here again. Now we've got two save files in case I royally F everything up. So thank you all for joining me on this episode of Indivisible, and I'm really looking forward to you guys coming and checking out the next one. But until next time, please take care, everybody.